My name is Joseph El Shaddai and I am one of the team instructors at Antfield where we use the power of play to build teams uh, to effectively communicate and also uh, do a couple of things and achieve goals effectively. Uh, the importance of uh, team building is actually uh, you know, wide uh, because it's through team buildings that team get to connect and know uh, one another because we find out that uh, uh, different people come from different backgrounds and of course each and every single person in maybe an organization like Artfield, uh, they, uh, they have different strengths and weaknesses. So if they come together as teams, they can achieve goals effectively uh, and collectively. But we add an aspect of uh, uh, games uh, to actually make it even more fun and interesting so that someone doesn't feel uh, forced to do something something but they will achieve a goal uh, through uh, entertain, entertainment, uh, games and of course different other fun activities that we carry out. So we do this uh, to build teams together to achieve goals and of course also to improve the power of communication uh, through uh, the different organizations and positions uh, you know different people hold in organizations and most importantly uh, we do these activities uh, to bring a unity among these organizations at the end of the day. Now, like for the activities we had today with uh, our partners at Field, uh, that definitely deals in different, uh, you know, fields uh, which where we have design. Uh, uh, of course, there is interior design, animation, and different other things. Uh, you find out that some of the activities we've done today, other games, uh, directly. Uh, connect with what is being studied right there. For example, unity. Most of the times, uh, unity is one of the major aspects that you will find in the workspaces whereby uh, some people need to work together to achieve a certain goal. If, if someone is actually looking for the best logo for a particular company, they have to consult uh, to, from uh, different people. And uh, it comes in uh, seamlessly and smooth if they are asking someone who they connect with at the end of the day. Uh, it's, no, it's so hard to connect with someone who you don't talk to, but through the games here, you get to know each other, and of course you talk to someone uh, seamlessly. So through that, we achieve that particular goal. And also, there are certain games that uh, also promote uh, the, the aspect of working together, whereby it is not like, uh, you know, there is no man who is an island. Uh, to achieve different uh, goals, uh, people have to brainstorm, come up with different, uh, you know, different uh, factors to achieve a certain goal. So you see, it is so easy if at all teams work together and they know each other. Maybe lastly, what I can talk about is that uh, uh, there is also an aspect of uh, understanding someone is strength and someone is weakness if in, uh, we very well understand that in organizations everyone has uh, what they know best and what they don't really know so if teams work together and get to know themselves you'll find out that someone who knows better will help this person who doesn't know at also get to their level at the end of the day and that effect happens uh, throughout the entire processes of work as well